Hi, I'm Mike Murphy, and welcome to The Short, the news roundup from IBM Research. First up, the future of semiconductor research comes to UAlbany. IBM and the University of Albany recently announced that a cluster of prototype IBM Artificial Intelligence Units, or AIUs, is being installed on campus. The new cluster will allow students, researchers, and faculty to run complex AI models that will push the boundary of what's possible in generative AI. These were built from the ground up for AI, and early tests have shown them to be more efficient than traditional CPU chips when it comes to AI inferencing. Next, a new way to protect AI models from attacks. We've all heard the horror stories about a self-driving car's AI model being tricked by hackers with stickers to run through stop signs that the car misinterprets. And it turns out there are all sorts of AI inferencing tools susceptible to attacks right now. And as part of a four-year program with DARPA, IBM has been working on tools to detect and secure AI models against attacks. The Adversarial Robustness Toolkit, originally designed by IBM, now supports popular hugging face AI models, meeting AI practitioners where they are. So if autonomous vehicles ever do show up, at least we know that they should be safe from hackers. Next, coupling magnets the size of a single molecule. Just in time for Valentine's Day, this is one of those stories that starts out small and will end up building to something massive. IBM researchers in Zurich recently had their work published in Nature Chemistry, where they reported they were able to synthesize a polycyclic conjugated hydrocarbon known as adenofluorine. I suspect it's even harder to have done that than it is just to pronounce it. The work was done under a combined scanning, tunneling, and atomic force microscope, operating at a cool minus 268 degrees Celsius, which is not much warmer than the vacuum of space. This was the first time that these tiny molecules' magnetism was actually controlled, and this could be super useful for future advanced sensors and a myriad of other applications. And in case you missed it, the AI Alliance is growing. The AI Alliance, the cross-industry group that believes open innovation is essential to develop and achieve safe and responsible AI, is expanding. The new members include the likes of Hitachi, University of Pennsylvania, Uber, and Snowflake. And they join others working to build inclusive AI, such as AMD, Meta, Intel, and oh yeah, IBM. The Alliance is also starting two working groups focused on AI safety and policy advocacy in the field. For more on the latest innovations from IBM, make sure you subscribe to our newsletter, Future Forward. Till next time.